Singapore is a very special case because this country has a fine uh, technology base in general, hmm, writ large. It has uh, a mature regulator, nuclear regulator. It has uh, very good uh, nuclear safety research capabilities. I think all of this groundwork has been done here. So in my uh, opinion, uh, when the, the, the country, the government, decides to move into, into a program, it, it would be relatively fast. It is clear you don't have the space to deploy uh, wind parks, as in some countries, um, or huge uh, spaces of uh, photovoltaic uh, platforms. Uh, there's no hydropower here in the uh, amount that is needed. So nuclear appears as quite logical option looking forward. For Singapore, there are no insurmountable challenges. The country will have to come to a point where the government will decide whether it is the time to do it, they are interested in doing it. No decision has been taken, as you know. And this has been reiterated to me today by the President, by the Prime Minister, by the Minister of Energy, but they are very interested in looking into this. So at some point they will make an evaluation and decide whether it is time to go in that direction or not at all. It is also possible, but I don't see, as I said, uh, any obstacle 